Hi all, in this video I want to present to you one useful uh, tool from IntelliJ, it's HTTP a client, uh, it's about ex making and executing uh, REST API calls. Previously I was using Postman, but when I found this I started to use it every day. So for this video I created one controller and I will write the requests for uh, this controller. So, uh, basically you're going uh, new HTTP request and I will write like users. So it will create to me a file that is users HTTP and I can write uh, the HTTP request. So let's say first I will write for get users. So I write get users. And it's, the syntax is pretty easy. I'm going get and control space I have suggestions. So I will start for HTTP localhost slash and I have suggestions to, for this. So uh, let's start the application let run yep so it started on port 8080 and i can uh, execute this request so if you can see i have a response it's pretty easy what is interesting here, same as Postman, you can use uh, variables, so you can add environment file. I will go with regular. So this is HTTP client environment JSON. Let's say local environment, variable host, and value let be HTTP local host port 8080. And here I can use the variable same as post. So it's pretty clear what I'm doing. And I will just show you how you can do a post request with the body and also how you can add a headers. So let that like post with body. So as I said, the syntax is clear. So we have post. It's pretty easy that you have auto completion. So API user. Now let's add the header. So application JSON and let's create the body. Let's see what is the body on the name parameter. Name, let's say, will be user C. And it's same like post header. API users with header. You can see that we have a navigation. It's pretty easy. The header name is X username. User D. And this is pretty fine that you can uh, have like versioning of this uh, request so it's pretty good so if you go run all requests we have run with local environment and you can see we have successful requests and the response are stored in this file so you can see the first one is user a user b for api users is user c and with header is user d so uh, this is pretty good so you can uh, commit your requests you can execute you can share you can version 
and you can uh, get rid of any other uh, HTTP clients and you can just stick with uh, IntelliJ. Uh, thank you for watching and you can find the code in the link in the description for the repository. Thank you.